Creating formulas. We can create a formula so that it will do uh, calculations on various cells. And we can perform calculations on a range of cells. So in this case, we might want to have the total square footage uh, of each office. So I can come over and click in this cell and I can start a formula by typing the equal sign in. Then I want to take this cell which is B3 so it's column B and it's row 3 which is going to be 12 so I can type in a left parenthesis and I type in B3 and then I'm going to do the multiply and the multiply symbol is the asterisk which is above the letter 8 we could also do um, you know the, the plus sign or the minus sign or the divide sign which is down below the question mark in this case we're going to multiply and I want to multiply times this 10 which is C3 so it's column C row 3 which is the 10 so it's C3 and I'm going to put that in a right parentheses and then I'm going to hit enter and you can see that it calculated th that value for me now if I were to come in here and change this value to say 14 you'll see that it automatically updates so anytime I come in here and make changes my values automatically update let's do that one more time. I'm going to come in here, I'm going to type in equals, I'm going to type in B4, B4, and I'm going to multiply it with the asterisk, and I'm going to go times C4, and then the right parentheses, and then I'm going to close my text editor, and now I get a value. So this is a big office. So you can see I can do various expressions with these uh, and that allows me to do a lot of calculations uh, in this case. Uh, now to do something really kind of on the fancy side is I can select these two and I can right click I mean I can actually click rather on this diamond and then right click and I can do a fill series uh, and I'm going to do a fill series and then I'll come down and click down to here and you'll see that it now I'll click out of there it actually built all the formulas for me and so when I click in here you can actually and I double click in here you can see it's B7 times C7 so it's taking this number times this number so it's really handy way of fast way of doing things so I have all of my uh, formulas built in this case.